Welcome back. If you're new around here, we're Charlie and Tasha, and we travel in our self-converted van with our two dogs, Riley and Winnie. We're in Ireland, the home of Guinness, rich Celtic culture, and breathtaking beauty. And this week, we experience some true Irish weather, go hiking in the Connemara National Park, and find some of our best beach park-ups to date. Good morning, welcome back to this beautiful location. We're currently parked on a strand near a little town called Quilty um, and the cows have come to join us this morning, which has been quite nice. The weather has, over the past few days, cooled down quite a bit now. It's now jumper weather, I would say. So we've got a nice sunny day ahead of us today, but it's, it's on the chillier side for sure. So we're gonna get off to the beach, dog walk first thing. driven about an hour north up the Wild Atlantic Way. We've just come to the Burren, is it a national park? It's the oh, it's just called an area just called the Burren, which we sort of researched online. It's like uh, the way the land is is a bit strange. And we've just arrived and it is, <laughs> it is a bit weird actually. So we're just gonna go out, leave the dogs here because it's quite stony and loads of places they can get their paws strapped. Um, and we're gonna have a little bit of a wander around. The whole landscape is very like like Giant's Causeway but not with the stacks it's um it's just very different it's uh I don't know if it comes across in the camera but it's, it's very strange very weird but it just goes for miles and miles got some true Irish weathers rolled in overnight. Um, we always park sensible and we did park sensible, but the way that we came in is currently flooded. So we're just gonna go and have a look and see if we can get out. Um, I'm not worried about getting stuck with the all trains on. I just don't wanna um, be bottoming out the van because there's a lot of rocks and uh, like big pebbles and stuff as we come in. So I don't wanna be ripping the bottom of the tank off. So we're just gonna go and have a look and see how bad it is. Jesus Christ. We came in via that route there and along here. But I'm going to try and go up there. There's the van, nice and high up. Wow, it really is blowing today. They did give it, but they gave it a little bit later. I think with the strong winds, it's probably come in a bit earlier. Welcome to Ireland, Billy! <laughs> but we can get out. Okay. Like now? Vinzo, you ready? <laughs> Ready to get out. We literally hopped straight out of bed. Tash saw it, so we've literally. I mean, I think I made a drink and I haven't even drank it yet. So, uh, yeah, time to get out of here. It is quite deep, but it's certainly doable. It's just they didn't want this scraping the van. I didn't like waking up to that too much. <laughs> Crikey. This is literally my worst nightmare. Good morning. Uh, we are north of Galway now. We're actually in the Connemara National Park. So we spent the weekend in Galway. I ran a half marathon. Uh, we just did a few little bits there. We've actually been there before, hence why we haven't filmed any of it. We went to start a hike yesterday and we did sort of an hour of it we did the lower loop and the wind was just too much it was just a bit ridiculous you could have done it don't get me wrong like if you were set to do it but being that we've got the time we thought we'd hold back and wait until today and although it's still raining we don't mind the rain the wind has died down considerably so we're going to go and do that hike today which looks really good
in our last video I think I said that it wasn't feeling very autumn yet in uh, Ireland but it's still feeling quite summery it feels very summery still yeah jinxed it didn't I Well, so far it's been fairly easy going, but here it's going to start getting a bit more challenging, I think. That is beauty. Winds are barely anything. What a view! <laughs> Always the way. But it's a nice hike. A bit of a view. A bit of a view for Project. <laughs> This is a circular route, we're just on our way back down now and the views are absolutely incredible. Yeah, I was just saying, if someone plunked me here, I would definitely think I was in Scotland, not Ireland, 100%. Did not expect this of Ireland. Like Wicklow Mountains felt very Irish, didn't it? It felt yeah, like, oh, we're definitely in Ireland. Green, very, yeah. Um, yeah, the, um, the Connemara um, National Park feels, yeah. It's like being in, Sc like being in Glencoe. Yeah. Which is, uh, we didn't have our YouTube channel then, but that's what we did at the beginning of the year. We were up in the Outer Hebrides, Isle of Skye, uh, North Coast 500, Glencoe. So yeah, it's quite fresh in our minds and yeah, this is brilliant. That's what we spent the afternoon hiking. That one just there. Now I'm emerging from the clouds now that we come down. This drive we're currently on is called the Connemara Loop. We said this already this morning on the hike, but I feel like we've been like transported back to Scotland or something. Uh, this, the Connemara, the bit we're actually on at the moment, we're actually driving around a lock, um, which I didn't realize there were any locks in Ireland, but there are. Yeah, it's incredible, absolutely incredible. This drive we're currently on is unreal. I didn't realise we'd see landscapes like this in Ireland. But lock to the left, a mountain to the right, sheep everywhere. And uh, unreal. So we've just made dinner for the evening, just sitting down and chilling out now. The weather's pretty awful. But we are on this awesome beach, ready for tomorrow. We're gonna call it for today, um, let this weather blow over and then in the morning, we're gonna have a wander down this beach because it's pretty big by the look of uh, Google Maps. So yeah, the weather is very unpredictable at the moment. So we're just trying to make the most of the sunny spots, quickly get out, do a walk. But this park up we're at is beautiful. There's one other van here. But the sun is trying, which is great. So we're just gonna get out now. Complaining about the weather this morning's worked because the sun's out. We've got this huge beach all to ourselves. We are in the middle of nowhere where we've parked, so I'm not surprised, but 
Yeah, this is a beauty. That afternoon, we took advantage of the sunshine and visited Downpatrick Head. The iconic, gigantic sea stack is one of the highlights of the rugged Atlantic coast in northern Mayo. Reaching a height of nearly 50 metres, the rock is visible from afar. who you might remember uh, we traveled through Skidar National Park with them uh, back in Montenegro that's where we first met these guys uh, the weather's cleared up actually it's a little bit windy but it's really beautiful uh, we got the fire going we've got a lovely wild park up here uh, sun shining although it's windy um, yeah we're gonna have some dinner <laughs> So we spent the last two days hanging out with Rob and Alice, which is um, really good fun as always. And uh, yeah, we he ended heading up into Galway for a night out. Which got a bit messy in the end, but yeah, it's proper good fun. So yeah, we've actually changed our plans a little bit. We've actually headed more inland. So, we can, uh, so we're just near Athlone at the moment. I think that's how it's pronounced, um, near a big lake couple reasons one we from Sligo up and around we've actually done that before in one of our previous little vans um, and two the weather's pretty crap up that way over the next uh, couple weeks so we thought we haven't done much of these so we thought we'd uh, explore from like Dublin up through so that's why we're heading back across but in the meantime we found some absolute gems this park up right at the moment it's great public toilets water bins um, and yeah some really nice little nature walks which the dogs are enjoying. So yeah, the plan is to start heading across east. Well, I think the story of this week has been gorgeous views, incredible park ups, lovely beaches, but with lots of running back to the van because of uh, rainstorms and stuff like that. That kind of sums it up quite nicely, yeah. isn't it? So yeah, we're gonna leave you there for this week. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you got this far, congratulations because it's a very mismatched video it's like over three weeks of filming because like we did the we went to the marathon in Galway and then we've met up with friends but catch us on the next one we're staying in Ireland we're heading east and uh yeah we'll see you there cheers see you on the next one